Now, I get it. You've been stuck at the same trophy count for weeks, and nothing you do pushes you up to that next trophy count. We've all been there, and it is a really frustrating stage of the game. Hey guys, this is right here, and today we are going to be talking about 5 reasons why you can't seem to push higher in trophies. So without further ado guys, let's go ahead and hop right into the list. Number 1. Bad Deck Probably the least important part of pushing, having a well-balanced deck can give you a slightly bigger advantage when pushing trophies. This means either taking the time to perfect a deck, or just using one that you know will work. Now if you are making your own deck, here are a few tips. 1. Pick a good win condition, not something unreliable such as spell damage. 2. Add solid troops that support your win condition. This varies according to your win condition. In beatdown decks, that usually means E Wiz or Night Witch. In Siege decks, that can mean Knight or Archers. Now, even though a good ladder deck won't guarantee you easy trophies, it definitely makes ladder pushing a lot easier. Number two, not knowing the proper counters. Like I just said, a deck doesn't guarantee trophies. You have to know how to play it well. Here's a scale I found to judge where you are in mastering a deck. The first deck is to first learn the deck. The second stage is to understand basic defense and attack mechanics. Number three is to understand the strategy and basically how the deck works. Number four is how to deal with certain archetypes. For example, in a mortar deck, you have to learn how to deal with hard matchups such as Royal Giant and Beatdown. Number five, making good decisions during pressurized situations. This means if there's a massive push and you're low on elixir, you need to know how to deal with situations like that. In number 6, we have master little strategic moves. These are just tiny little tips that will greatly improve your gameplay. And if you've reached stage 7, that means you have completely mastered the deck. As you can see, it takes some investment and time to actually master a deck, but once you do, it really pays off. Number 3, tilting. Staying in the right mindset is just as important as mastering a deck. Preventing tilting is such a hard thing for so many people, and even the best pros will suffer from it. There are many ways people deal with tilt. Most pros say that they remind themselves that this is just a game. Personally, I like to tell myself play defensively over and over again as it prevents me from playing too badly. And if it gets really bad, you have to know when to stop playing. Take a quick break and come back another time when you've cooled down. Number 4. Not adjusting to your playstyle This may seem really obvious to most experienced players, but a different deck archetype has a different playstyle. I can't tell you how many times I see my friends around the 3000 trophy mark playing a mortar deck like a beatdown, or a beatdown deck like a control deck. This can be much harder for people who often switch decks, and it's definitely a skill that can be learned quickly and effectively. Number 5. Overinvesting Now while this is more of a general gameplay tip, overinvesting in your pushes is the single mistake that will lose you most of your games. Knowing just the right moment to go all out and when to hold back on elixir is extremely difficult to learn. You have to constantly keep track of your opponent's cycle, what cards they have in hand, the stage of the game, your opponent's elixir, and so much more. This is a skill that I haven't even mastered yet. Although it does take a lot of time to learn, once you do master elixir management, winning will seem a whole lot easier. Alright guys, so there are 5 reasons why you can't seem to push higher in trophies. Hopefully after using any of these 5 methods, you can at least push a little bit higher on the ladder. But unfortunately guys, that is all the time for in today's video. If you enjoyed, please like down below as well as a subscription to my channel. And as always, this is Legend Array, and I'm signing off. See you guys next time.